Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Dr. Robinson again, and we're going to continue our studies. So uh, please watch our show, Math Time, on Tuesdays at 4.30 p.m. to 5 p.m. on Optimum Cable Vision Channel 15. You'll see some students, some of your favorite teachers, in there doing some nice mathematics. Please check out our channel on YouTube. My channel name is Dan Robinson. We have some nice tutorial videos for you. Here's our latest release, PKM S Math Prep 18. I think you'll like the movie. It's a very good movie, and it'll tell a very nice story about students and their mathematics. So you can tweet us at DRobMath1. Please subscribe, by the way, and give us a thumbs up. Let us know how we're doing on our videos. Okay, so we're going to log in with Clever. This time it's for teachers. So how to log in to the Big Ideas textbook for teachers using Clever. All right, first thing you do, you first go to the website, Big Ideas Math, and uh, when you get there, uh, the, the screen should come up, and the first thing you do is go down to the blue button where it says Log in with Clever, so press that first. After that, you'll see this screen where it says log in, search for your school. So all you do is type your school's name. You'll see it there by typing a few letters. So type your school's name, Peekskill Middle School, and you'll see us. You'll come to this screen where it's going to give you login credentials uh, 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 solicitation. So you have to type in your teacher ID number and then your password. It's, uh, there's a generic password that we've given you to use and you'll be able to prompt it to change it to the password that you like for yourself. Then you press log in, and you should be logged in after that. Here's the screen you'll see where uh, our basic setup where you have to press the three lines here. When you press that, that'll get us to this screen where we can now go into our class management tab. So please press that. So we can see our classes that we have. It's already scheduled. All your classes in there are listed out. And so now you have to select a book for your classes. Notice there's books here. And some classes have books, but some do not. So you need to select a book for the class. So let's go to the next screen. So when you click on the class, there's a names of your students down there. Hmm, Bart Simpson in there. Uh, there's a little icon right here where it says book. So if you press that, you can select the textbook or textbooks. So select that. And it gives you the list of books that we have purchased. So you can select any one of them, all three of them if you like, or any combination thereof. So for your grade, press save so we can save the changes. That'll save the changes for that class that you have selected. And if you notice, I selected my accelerated class, and then we're using the grade seven book and one more. That one more would be the eighth grade book as well. So I have to do that for each class. So I have to select that for my third period, my fourth and sixth period, eighth grade class as well. So that way they can have books as well because I may want to decide to use a different book. So let's go back to press the three lines here. And it brings you back to this page where you'll see your books that you have available to use for the, those classes that you have selected. Here's my accelerated class that I selected, and they have these two books that I selected for them. So now you can rock and roll. So I hope you understand what's going on in the video. You may uh, see me uh, privately or write me an email. If you have questions, this is my formative assessment page where I check for understanding. So I ask my students to vote A if they understand or B if they're not, not certain and write down their questions and bring them in. So watch this video on YouTube again if you have questions. My channel name is Dan Robinson. Look for our new math video, PK, PKMS Math Prep 18. We're working on 19 as we speak. Tweet us at DRobMath1. And I think you'll like our other tutorial videos. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to check out our, sh our show, Math Time, on Tuesdays at 4.30 to 5 p.m. on Optimum Cablevision. And give us a thumbs up on our YouTube videos, by the way, so that way we know we're doing well. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope I wasn't too long. You have a good day. And remember, if you have questions, write me, and I'll answer them.